I just tossed them on there, yeah. Should we do it? Yeah. Alright. Wherever they, wherever they were, wherever it may roam. You do, I told you, you, I did my part, you do your part, and then we'll get it out. <coughs> is this it? Like, this is it? That's all that's left? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I did everything. Wow. Not really, though. I did half of it. You're doing half of it. Are we opening those boxes or sending them? I'm doing the hard part. Um, I'll ask Wilson. You're kind of doing the... Oh, my. What is this? Sons of Anarchy. Someone bought a case of Sons of Anarchy. Who did it? Yes. Who did? Swamp. Swamp Yak. We got your order, dude. And got the Bruce Lee. Sons of Anarchy, season four through five, 12 box case. We better get a Henry Rollins auto. This is super duper. Hey, Henry Rollins died. You know who Henry Rollins is? Oh, wait a minute. Is he from the Rollins band? Yes. Henry Rollins band, yes. You know what he also did? Flag Flag. He did, he was, uh... Black flag. <coughs> I'm trying to think, did he do some paranormal stuff? I believe he did. He does a lot of stuff. Yeah, he's a cool guy. Henry Rollins does everything. He's super cool. He was in the Tool song, uh... It's my, uh, it's my mom's kind of music. No, it's not like it. Even... Oh my. Yes. Do you watch Sons of Anarchy? No. Great, because I don't either. Who cares? We're going to have fun doing this. I guess. <clears throat> I watched the first two episodes, so it's going to be a surprise well, for everybody. You watch more than I have, so Check out this yours. super cool Bruce Lee print signed by the artist. Signed by Bruce Lee. The very best. It's not. That's a <laughs> false. That is so cool. Oh, that is cool. All right. Yeah, and it's, dude, it's awesome. Bruce Lee Nobody makes Bruce bleed his own blood. Nobody. Except in this it's so cool that artist Bruce rendition. It. So huh? awesome that Bruce Lee that. Dude, here we go. Sons of Anarchy. Okay, we've been asking the whole time. If you got a case of psych, I would have been pumped because I watched it. This is crazy. I've, the whole time I've been working here, the last couple months, I've been hoping for a non-sports break. Oh. And it's not even like a little one. It's a whole case. We did, I did a couple boxes of Breaking Bad when it came out. Very nice. Did you watch Breaking Bad? Uh, part of it, not the whole thing. Is there any like Cryptozoic product cards that you, you have watched? I don't know. I don't know the whole Cryptozoic library of cards. Did they do Lost? No, I don't think they did. No, they didn't do Lost. But Lost did have cards. I know, I did. I wa Well, I'm just saying I watched that. I have some of them, yeah. All right, here we go. Check out the box. Sons of Anarchy. There's so much TV on. That's the problem. you got to pick and choose. This is on Netflix. This is kind of the reason why I never got into it. We watched the first couple episodes. and Same thing with Breaking Bad. Right, that's what I'm saying. There's just so many shows I pick and choose. You know, you just got to pick and choose. I want them to have What'd you say? They should have Seinfeld cards too. I'm surprised they didn't. I mean, clearly somebody had to ask and they just said no. Yeah, that's probably what happened. Because it's. It's clearly. It'd be clearly a moneymaker. Oh, it'd be You can. Yeah. But there's, like there's actually been a lot of people that have just been on an episode that they, they could make a yeah. crazy autograph yeah. checklist. Yeah. I mean, checklist. and they could really play on the show about nothing, cards about nothing. Like, I don't know. It just, it's, it makes itself, but. Well, think of it. They haven't even done, they don't even have like pops of them. They have pops of everything. So clearly someone's just saying no Seinfeld anything. Like the little pop figures. They do pop figures of every, oh. every, you know what I mean? Like, they don't, there's none of that stuff either of science. There's nothing. Yeah, it's very protective. So, all right, let's see what we get here. What is it? Look for randomly inserted autographs and wardrobe. Oh, here. Um, autographs are one in, yep, one of each. Total odds of finding a special insert are one in 12, so. So you should get. Ooh, 
Ooh. Dude, this is... Look at this. The beards. The beards, man. This is real men. This is real man's cards. Probably never. I had a beard when I was born, so... It's a fun fact. I couldn't think of myself. I look like a overgrown baby. Like this, four or five years, and I've always had some sort of facial hair since I was like a junior. A Not just a mustache. No, I never did that. Juan Carlos. Are these little? What are these little? G2. Oh, wait a minute. Those actually might be a special set. There we go. Okay. Ryan Hurst is Opie. This, fun fact, he's actually going to be at the uh, Niagara Falls Comic Con. And supposedly his dad's supposed to be coming. His dad was a played a character on um, the Dukes of Hazzard. Um, and the fun fact, another fun fact, is he was in uh, Remember the Titans. Played the linebacker. But he didn't have any facial hair then. Tommy Flanagan is Flip Chibs Telford. G8, and Katie Seagal is Gemma Teller Morrow. She's on, uh, what's it called? She was on Lost. She was on, she's in Futurama too. And she was on Married with Children. And Futurama. With Al Bundy. Yeah, but Futurama was better. Mmm, debatable. I don't know what you're talking about. You're not Very debatable. The X. That Futurama is better than Married with Children? Yes. That's very debatable. Super debatable. Married with Children was better than Futurama. That's... Futurama's better. Uh, I think it just depends on when you grew up and when you watched the shows. I don't think that's correct. Ooh, we got something. We got ourselves a hit. Who is it? Permont. Penny Winston, played by William Lucking. We have an authentic wardrobe card. Very that. nice. It's got the little sticker in the bottom. His sweat is in that card. That's really cool. Smells of rich mahogany. It doesn't. I didn't smell it. That'd be kind of weird. But you can smell it at home if you'd like. Oh, we got our auto. Boom, boom. Just like that. David, no, the Brava as Happy. Cool. He's got a little SOA on there, Sons of Anarchy. That's really cool. Plays Happy. I like the, look at the graphic on the back. That's really cool. Huh. That's quite the, quite the name for that one. Ron Perlman is Clarence Clay Morrow. The mayor. It's nice. You'll definitely get a whole set. Plus some. Alright, let's see if we can get a bonus hit. Charlie. Oh, there we go. Jax Teller. It's funny seeing some of these actors, though, because I know them from other shows. Oh. But what it happens? Like, NYPD Blue, but he's, but it's not, because he's on this show. I didn't watch that. I didn't watch it either, but, I mean, I saw the, ad, the ads for it. Old. I'm wise. I don't know about that. I'm a wise old man. I'm a wise old man. Yeah, look at, the, look at that guy, dude. He's grizzly. That's the guy I want on my side when things go, go okay, south. Wait. That's the kind of guy that I give a chocolate candy bar and I'm like, hi friend, how are you doing? So when things go south, he's like, oh dude, that guy gave me a candy bar. He's cool, let him go. It's things you gotta think about. Just saying. Another one of these little cards. Theo Rossi is juice. I love the names. Happy Juice. Bobby Elvis. Come on now. Bobby Elvis. 
character. I like him even more. He's got the crazy hair, and his name is Elvis. I'll give you credit. Your name's Elvis. Yeah, right. I'm thinking about naming my son Elvis. Yeah, buddy. I would definitely name my son Elvis. You would name your son Elvis? I would totally do it. But then you'd have to tell people that you named him after Elvis Doomerville. No, I named him after <laughs> Elvis Costello. Oh, okay. Yeah, you could do that, too. Card double zero. But Elvis Sons of Anarchy. And Elvis Presley had influence. This is season four and five of Sons of Anarchy. Feel free to put in a personal order. We'll have a little bit of time left. I'm just cracking a case right now. The Sheriff. He's been on some stuff. Some of these actors look familiar. Oh, is this oh is this a sticker? Oh no, it's uh it's a tattoo. How awesome is this? It is a tattoo. This is sweet. You got an official Sons of Anarchy tattoo card. That's really cool. Tig? This guy's name is Tig. Tig. T-I-double-G-R. Uh, T-I-G. It was a reference to Winnie the Pooh. Yeah, yeah, I gotcha. Opie? It's Opie again. All right, first box. First box down. Got the tattoo autograph, and the memorabilia card. The auto and memorabilia came real quick. I love it. it the pack says official license contraband. Just playing up with the show. I like it. Oh, a sketch would be sweet. Let's see what we can get here. There is only one. That's right. That's the only one that you can get. Chuck. He looks familiar too. Ooh, what is this? Oh, nice. How about a card numbered out of 25? Oh, crap. I think Henry Rollins. I don't know if Henry Rollins. The Suns Return. Yeah, 7 of 25. Four? Yeah, season 4 or 5. Oh, okay. <clears throat> there you go. 7 of 25. That's a nice little hit. Can't go wrong with a, a little parallel card out of 25. We're going to look at the signers for this. Because I don't know what kind of realm is this. Because it's in season one through three. Well, we hit a nice out of 25 parallel. It doesn't, I mean, on the box itself, it only talks about, it just says, all they talk about are autographs. In wardrobe cards, which is kind of cool though. You can uh, you can do the no purchase necessary thing. Just send your name with a postcard in there, and if you get pulled, you you get a you get a hit. I've done that before. All right, come on, let's keep this going. Oh, we got something. Oh, bears. Tara Knowles Teller, played by Maggie Siff. Very cool. There's actually a little design in the... There you go, you can see it. Very cool. Wardrobe piece.
you know, the first set that always comes out is special because it's the first set. But usually if things go good for the first set, the second series they put out sometimes has more bells and whistles. So, it would seem to be this follows suit. Oh, what do we got here? Nice, got another tat. What would Gamma do? Very nice. There you go. And we got our... Oh, nice. Ryan Hurst auto. That's who you want. That's a good one to get. As Opie. Opie and Anthony. There you go. Ryan Hurst. That's a decent auto right there. So, that Ryan I know. Yep. Get Jack's signed, I guess. Um, Ron Perlman signed. We got your Ron Perlman. He's awesome. In honor of Paul, we have to get Ron Perlman. And this All right, we're off to a good start here. Two tattoos and a bonus numbered card. Do you know who Kenny Johnson is? No. Tom Arnold signed? Oh, we gotta get Tom Arnold on. Alright, we're gonna try, we're gonna try. You, how are you not pumped about Tom Arnold? Ah, yeah, we just pulled that one. Not Tom Arnold? No. Oh. The last card you showed. Oh, the way you showed. Oh. Um, yeah, Tom Arnold, dude. Nine months, he was funny in that movie. Actually, he too. beat up a dinosaur in that movie. It was funny. That wouldn't make sense, but he signed it in uh, what's it called? The castle. The castle. Let's keep this going. Nice. Juan Carlos Ortiz, Juice, played by Theo Rossi. It's kind of cool. I don't know if it's going to come up in the camera. There is two colors on the... You can kind of see it. Right there in the bottom corner. Very cool. This is a fun break. Oh, we got our auto. Oh, yes. Ron Perlman yes, auto. Very Ron nice. Dude. Dude, the pit boy. Yes, the pit boy is excited. Yeah. Ron Perlman. Very cool. Clay Morrow. Clarence Clay Morrow. Very cool. Now we got to get Tom Arnold. There we go. Tom Very nice hit. Uh, you know, my, I, this is Sean breaking the cards. The ambient voice that you hear wishing for Tom Arnold is Alex. If I could stop him, I would. Hey, it's not wishing. We want Tom Arnold. No, Ray. he doesn't want him, though. How do you not want Tom Arnold? He, he doesn't want Tom Arnold. He was married to Roseanne Barr. Yeah, well, a lot of people probably were. 
What if the Tom Arnold autographs go for thousand dollars on eBay? It probably doesn't, because he probably has done his research. <laughs> if we get a Tom Arnold, it's on you, dude. It's on you. I'm sorry, I just want to have fun. <laughs> I love Tom Arnold. That's the worst nickname ever, Dave. I like it. The more words in a nickname, I the better it is. He needs the whole set, so you know it's not a big deal if he gets it. I like. I just like making fun. But we got Ron Perlman. That's 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 good enough. My uh, my my goal is to defy the odds. Oh wait a minute. That's. Oh. Theo Rossi. How about a. 8 of 10 card. I knew that looked a little different. There we go. Let me make sure it gets in the focus. That's, there it is. That's cool. 8 of 10. It's got that little red Sons of Anarchy right there. Very nice. That is cool. Oh, that's a sweet looking. Check out that. Tat. Can you put like send us pictures like tw like send us pictures of like the tattoos? Yeah, this is definitely like like actually put the tattoos on and like just like show like send us some pictures of them like on your uh, arm or something. These are always fun. <laughs> Skin should be clean and free of oil. <laughs> Hey, that's things I can't say, so you keep typing away. Oh, if I got a case of this, I would put all the, the tattoos just on my arms. Uh -oh. You would. A biker. You would do that. I'd feel, I'd, yeah, I would. You would. That's why I said I did. I, I know, no questions asked. No questions asked. No one would even have to dare you. No one would have to dare me. That's a fact. <laughs> Just come in. Alex has his head shaved and all his tats are on his forehead on his head. Is that okay? That'd actually be kind of funny. What? You just shaved your head and you no. just put all the tats on there. I don't know. They've got a lot of hair up there right now. Got a Tara Knowles Teller by Maggie Siff. It's their second memorabilia piece. It is different, though. And they do have uh, different numbering. So that's good. Keeping it. Got to keep them different. Yeah, go ahead. Ask the question. What's up, Andrew? Come on. Let's keep it going here. Let's get a sketch card. That would definitely... Got a couple of nice low numbered parallels. The tats are always a nice touch. Got our oh nice Katie Seagal auto. Yeah, there you sick. go. Gemma. Gemma. What did I say Gemma? A Gemma. Yeah. I, yeah, I said Gemma. Yeah. Very nice. That is Pro a huge Futurama. hit. Pro Futurama. Very nice. Everybody knows her from something. I know her from Married with Children and being John Locke's girlfriend in Lost. Leela from, from Futurama. Yeah, but see, that's not real. Like That is real. It's a cartoon. That is it's real. her voice. It's real in my in my heart. But it's it's just a So you get six members of the club and six randoms. Oh, that oh, John Ritterso. That's Eight right. Simple rules. That was a great show, actually. Oh, it was a great show. And the girl from Bing Bang Theory was on it, and then when he passed away, James Garner and David Spade were on the show. It's unfortunate. It was a very good show. Almost forgot about that one.
Come on, sketch card. Eight simple rules to dating my teenage daughter. Oh, we got another tat. Let's see, what does this one say? What does that say? It's backwards. Redwood original. Redwood original. Gotta give me a second and put it together. It's Redwood original. He That's what, what I I about. just said it. He knows what he's talking he about. He knows what he's talking about. I know he knows what he's talking about. Alright, let's get Tom Arnold. <sighs> it's just... It's because Tom Arnold was in Soul Plane. And it's an amazing It's movie. what you want. Like, I'm a huge fan of Savage, but I don't ask for Savage. But when Savage happens, <laughs> I freak out. But I don't do that to people. He needs a whole set. Tom, he needs a whole set. If he gets more than one... There will be some explaining to do. Oh, <laughs> I, I, I can appreciate that. Come on now. Well, we got two really good, we got two cool autographs. Now yeah. we gotta get that, the Jax guy, the main character, which would be cool. Done good so far, that's for sure. Oh, that's cool looking. Just on Tom Oh my gosh. <laughs> It'll be like a cone head. I don't think, I, I don't know if any <laughs> artist would take the time to sketch that out. Well, was he in cone heads? No. That was Dan Aykroyd. Yeah. Oh, I'm wrong. Really? Yeah. You no, need a timeout. He was another thing. That's not even close. Yeah, he was, he got, yeah, that, read that. Oh, <gasps> what? Yeah, you would. I told him you would have cried. Oh my, that is fantastic. I mean, if you're gonna be savaged, it may as well be a one on one out of National Treasures. That's there. I mean, then that's that's a decent card. You know what? I appreciate it. I give you the air high five. Oh, oh. There's another, another numbered card. Oh my gosh, another out of ten. Seven of ten. <laughs> Hold on, it's blurry as forever. It's kind of hard to read. Oh man. Yeah, it doesn't want to. Oh, there we go. You can kind of see it now. Seven of ten. Very nice. I think we should we should open. Psych. Val Kilmer autographs. Are you kidding? Dual autos of Dual Hill. How about we do another? This is the front. Eight of 25. You pulled two numbered cards out of this box. Oh, eight of 25? Yeah, we pulled this... a 7 of 10 and an 8 of 25. No, it was an 8 of 10. Or 8 of 10. So, yeah, eights. That's so crazy. All about that eight, man. <laughs> oh, we got our auto. Uh, Dayton Kelly as Wayne Unser. There's that one. The key to our success is just getting different cards. That's that's what we're at right now. I don't think we would get double autographs. Next you never know, though, man. I guess you could. Especially if there's not a lot of signers. Well, I guess so. Here. 
Oh, nice. Happy Loman. Check that out. It's a cool little piece. His name's Happy. Just like nice. Oh, okay. That's cool. That's the actual one. Come on, sketch card. We've already gotten a couple of low-numbered inserts, or parallels, rather. I, yeah, I don't know. That, I guess that's a possibility. Hopefully we pull one. Here we go, Kim Coates as Tig. He's he is he's been in stuff. I have seen him in I feel like I've seen him in movies. What's his name? Kim Coates. Yeah, I just I'm trying to think of where I've seen him before. I know what you're talking about. I think I've seen him in Guess uh, who he street was. Street Carb Name Desire, Macbeth. Um. Why is it? Oh my gosh. I'm going to feel like a fool when I find out what oh, it is. Oh, he was in Waterworld. <laughs> I don't He's know. been in some other stuff. Oh, here we go. Who do we got? We got Happy's Autograph with a happy smiley face. Very cool. He was on Prison Break for six episodes. Crap. <laughs> Why is that a crap? Well, fill me in here. Oh, check it out. Check it out. Yes. Whoa. How about a printing, printing plate? Printing plate. Is that... Oh, is that... What's his face? Yeah, from NYPD Blue. Very nice. Congratulations. This is a cyan printing plate. That's not Jimmy Smith's, is yeah, it? Yeah, Jimmy Smith. That's Jimmy Smith's yeah. printing plate? Oh, yeah. my gosh. Yes, that is correct. We got it. You, did, you know what you didn't do? No, because it, it's not stamped. Oh, it's not stamped. No. Right there. There she is. Wow, it's getting all kinds of cool Jimmy little Smith. extras. Oh, that's awesome. Can I see that? How is this not numbered 101? Right because they don't number them. I guess they don't. Because they know that it's not it's worth special. it. It's better to not number it. Jimmy Smith's. Legendary. Is that? Do you think that's the extra hit, or do you think that's just throwing? I don't know, man. I. It could be. Yeah, no, I have no idea. That's a win. If you ask me. There's no only the autographs. They they have autographs and memorabilia. 
is one in 24, and inserts in general are in one in every 12. So they only talk about those. They don't talk about any of these other stuff. Well, that could still be considered an insert, but like a rare insert. They had one per... All right. So that could be it. Another tat. Gotta get them hoots. Well, what extra hit are you talking about? There's that one. There's the extra hit per case. Like there's, Where does it say that? You said that. There's the one tw uh, twenty. No. Oh. No. I didn't say it. it's not per case. It's per box. Oh, per box. Oh, it's no. just, it just says one in 12 packs. The odd, the total odds of finding a special insert are one in 12 packs. Oh, I feel that. I feel you. I feel you. Never mind. Are we going to get more pudding plates? I just misheard you. It's cool. I think you said one in 12 boxes. No. No, no, no. Let's get some. Come on now. He was in Battlefield Earth? Oh my That's God. what I know him from. Oh That's God. what I know him from. I knew I knew him from something. Oh, check this out. This is a sweet little piece. Rat Boy. Oh my gosh. That's what you know him from. I love Look at it. the... That's pretty cool. Looking. That is actually, is that like a, is that like jeans or is that? Like yeah, yourself? it's like a, I think it's the pocket. Oh, that's a cool card. That's really cool. Anyways, what's up? Very cool. Oh, are you, are you, are you doing lunch? Can you bring some nasty thing? Very nice. Uh, yeah, probably. Oops, what am I doing? Huh. I don't care. I'm coming up. I'm coming up. Hold on, guys. I have to make oh, here we go. Rachel Miner. Don Traeger. Autograph. Little heart on there. Sketch card. Got a, another tat. Numbered card. Call Lowen, nine of twenty five. Yes, the Drew Brees numbered one. <laughs> what is it? That's funny. The last card I pulled. What was it? Was it 99? 9, nine? nine of 25. Oh, 9 of 25. Okay. Yeah, he's just trying I to be funny. That. I didn't know what it was. I didn't know he's trying to be funny. That was good. That's all right. He wore 15 in college, so if we get a 15 one. Yeah, see, the things you learn. How do you know I didn't know that already? I don't know if you did know that. 
I don't know if I knew it. I don't even know. Come on now. There's any. I got the website. Do really? Yeah. I want to put a Bills one on there. Fear the Reaper. Uh, oh, that's so cool. Oh, I would so put that on my arm. Or my forehead. Yeah. Like, yeah. Or my neck. Get a neck autograph. A neck tattoo. A neck autograph. A neck autograph. No, that's the word. My mom thinks that Blue Oyster Cult's my favorite band. It's not. It's just Why does she think? She thinks like it? any music that has like a guitar in it is like, like sinful. <laughs> I'm not lying. Yeah. My mom's favorite band is Metallica and Tool. She That's also likes quality. Marilyn Manson. That's a quality mother. Yep. All about, yeah, no kidding. My mom likes Barbra Streisand and Journey. Too bad they didn't have a, oh, a so, Megan was that, Trainer. Was that apparel? Was it? Oh, there it is. Okay, that's cool. A Jack Another hologram. 11 of 25. Not a hologram, but it's a foil. It's, it's, it's shiny. It's a shiny foil. Shiny Jack's card. Nice. We have Tori Kittles as Leroy Wayne. Tori Kittles, what is he from? He's Carrie Kittles' brother. I don't know. What were you going to say? I don't know about who. You know who Carrie Kittles is. Basketball player. Oh, yeah, I do know who Carrie Kittles yeah. is. Meh. He's only one degree away from 50 cent. I'm only two degrees away from Craig T. Nelson. And you're three three degrees away. Craig T. Coach? The actor who played Coach? Oh, and the Incredibles guy? He was Mr. Incredible. Unbelievable. I remember. You're three degrees away from him. How? Because I'm two degrees away and you know me. I met the kid, and I met and talked with the little, like, the guy who played the boy in Poltergeist. And he was oh, in that was movie. Bad, yeah. yeah, see? Six degrees. Well, everybody's you six, him. everybody's six degrees. No, it's just the degrees away from them. I guess so. You just knew when you know, I talked to him. I talked to him for 20 minutes. That's long enough to know somebody. I know where he lives. Flip Telford, Chibs, played by Tommy Flanagan. Very nice. I know Miss Mister Incredible. Oh, that's. They're bringing Coach back, actually. What? The reviving Coach. Yeah, fun fact. They're bringing Coach back, and it's gonna revolve around his son. If you remember Coach in the later years, he actually, I believe, adopted a son. He had a daughter, and that son now, it's actually gonna just go, however many years it's been, and he is a coach, and he's gonna bring his dad out of retirement to help him. That, this is true. I saw it. You're not lying. Philip. You said flip. Ah! <laughs> That's funny. It is Philip. I completely disregarded the other I that was in that name. Disregard. Hey, listen. I'm an equal opportunist. I will mess up professional athletes' names, and I will mess up professional actors' names, because that's what I do. 
consistency is key. They're no better or no worse. There is a copious amount of base cards right now. Oh, we got something. What do we got? Oh, Wendy Case. Very, very nice. She's been in a few things. It's a little black piece of wardrobe. What is this? Oh, how about this? How about a duel? Tig and Happy dual memorabilia piece. Yeah, dog. There you go. A little dual action. All about that. Tig, I knew I knew him. Battlefield Earth. That's what I know him from. <laughs> not, I think we're, we, that's, oh, not, I love that movie. It's not as bad of a movie as people make it no, sound. No, no, it's an awful movie, but it's an amazing it's movie. It's not the worst movie ever created no, no, in the, the history of, ever, it is not the worst movie ever. It's the best awful movie ever. I can think of many other worst movies. Yeah. What do we got here? <laughs> Jeff Kober as Jacob Hale. You, what are you doing? I'm just dying. Are you are you I laughing at your own I joke? Stop. I have to laugh. I'm just Were laughing. you laughing at your own joke? No, I'm laughing at Battlefield Earth. Just the great. Oh just the great movie my. Well, there's autograph cards of that. Like John uh, John Travolta has an autograph Battlefield Earth card. Why wouldn't he? Because he's amazing. I'm totally getting one of these days. Yeah? There's a couple autograph sets that I have to get before I die. I'm working on the Lost autograph set. That's a that's a I big epic. I want to get the Batman and Robin one from 1997. So it's like my favorite movie ever. They had autograph cards in yeah. that? Yeah. George Clooney. Oh, gosh. Schwarzenegger. That is... See, okay. Oh, it's expensive. It's like a... No, I'm house. saying that... You don't like that movie, though, right? Oh, I love that movie. It's so bad. It's amazing. That was my movie when I was a kid, man. That's, that's, that explains a lot. Yeah, I know. Like how you love that stupid Fred Savage stuff. Yeah, but there's nothing, oh man, you can't even equate the two. Fred Savage, it, bat nipples and, and Fred Savage <laughs> are not equatable at all. They're not, it's not even a, a contest. Oh, jeepers. Let's focus on the Sons of Anarchy here. So we got an extra extra memorabilia. That duel was an extra hit. And we got our sticker. This case has been very nice. It's treating you well, Chris. It's treating you well. The Sons of Anarchy like the swamp. It's a fact right now. Alright, three more boxes. Three more chances at a sketch card. Well, you never know. I mean, I don't know if it's deserved. The case has already provided some out of 10 cards, a dual memorabilia, two nice autographs. Maybe that's where they draw the line. They just, maybe they load up a box with a, or a case with a bunch of hits with no sketch. Or you just get your normal cards and a sketch. I don't know. But we still got three boxes. Let's see. I think a sketch would be would just cap this ridiculous case, in my opinion. There you go. A little tat. Uh, no, no manufactured patch.
don't see any thick packs yet. I'm trying not to look though. I don't even want to look. I don't want to ruin it for anybody. So we'll see what happens. Oh, we got an autograph. Who do we got? Chris Browning as Gogo. <laughs> that eh, that might be one of the better responses to a hit that I have pulled in any case or box that I have opened. Unfortunately, I cannot repeat it, but it is super fantastic. That's true. It is better than Tom Arnold. Well, Alex left the room, so hopefully any Tom Arnold mojo he was hoping for left the room with him you asked for it you shall receive official contraband check it out you asked for it and there's your patch and it probably couldn't be any better than that a replica patch from the vest worn how sweet is that? That's really cool looking, man. I'm not going to lie. I definitely saw a thick pack there. I just didn't want to ruin it for you. Needed it to be a surprise till we got to the end. And we have a Tower Nose Teller. Very nice. Cool thing is this is the third patch card you've pulled of her but they're all different so that's cool all different all different numbering so what is this are you kidding a katie seagal william luck up uh, look at that another duel that might be from a dress That's crazy. That's really cool. I like how the picture shows you. It's not a dress. It's a shirt. The picture behind you shows you where they pulled it from. That's really cool. This case. I mean, I, I don't know. I haven't opened any other cases of this, but this case just seems to be pretty loaded. I mean, if every case is like this, this is a hot product to buy. Got two more boxes, and you got two bonus dual memorabilia cards. <laughs> Let's see. You asked for the manufactured patch, and you got it. So we're sending all the all the vibes for that. Bring us a sketch card. We're trying to have a sketch rally right here. Oh, this is a numbered card. 23 of 25. here Bobby Munson very nice piece of his shirt authentic war uh, wardrobe
Got her. Got an autograph. There you go, William Lucking. Any? I like that. Put his name in quotes right there for you. You want a recap of all your hits? Is that what you're asking for? Do you, okay, yeah, do you want the whole, do you want this whole break or just the hits? Another tat. I can put the whole break up if you want it. Okay, yep. It'll take, it, it'll just take me a little bit. I gotta cut the video. I'll cut out everything so it's just the beginning of your case break till the end of it. But I'll work on getting it up. Two more packs and then the box. No problem at all, man. This has been a blast. I'll tell you that. I'm having... I know... See, this is the thing. I'm having a blast doing it, and I don't even watch the show. So I know you're having fun because you know more about the show than I do. All right, here we go. Last box. We've already pulled some amazing things. Let's, let's see if we can end on something cool. Eli Roosevelt, Rockman Dunbar. There we go. All right, come on, we got one more auto. Our one autograph left. It's Kim Coates. There you go. You were right. They did do a very good job with their collation. Not a single double on all your hits. That's really cool, actually. All your numbered cards. I think the tattoos might have been the only thing. I think there were a couple of doubles of your tattoos. But all your numbered cards, your dual memorabilia, your memorabilia autos, there wasn't a single double. That's... I don't think you can say that about every case. I mean, of other cards, especially in sports cards, there's there's always a chance you're going to pull the same the same auto or memorabilia card out of it. So that's cool. Was there a happy auto? Did I just give a big long speech and there was a double? Do you mean I'm going to have to retract my last statement? I'll take a look. I said my short-term memory was terrible. Hold on, let me see. I'll look, and if so, I'm going to have to use my mulligan for the day on that last little speech I gave. Tattoo. Oh, but 
a nice, got a numbered card, 15 to 25. And our last pack. No sketch card. Did not get the sketch. Numbered tattoo auto. Auto memorabilia numbered. Dual member memorabilia. Printing plates. Forgot about that. You know what? They're not the same card. You did get two happy cards, but they're not the same. So that's kind of cool. This is from a different set. Authentic autographs. This is numbered A. Oh, check it out. This is from seasons one through three. That's why. That's kind of cool. There you go. Yeah, so you got... This happy, Opie, Clay, Gemma, Wayne, Dawn, Leroy, Jacob, Gogo, Penny, Tig, and you're extra happy. You got your, is it Nero? Did I do the, yeah, Nero printing plate. Your tattoos. A couple of doubles in your tattoos. Just doing a hits recap. I don't... There's that. Maggie. Another Maggie. Theo. Or, I'm saying that right. Juan Carlos. Tara. Tara. Uh, Happy. Tig. Rat Boy, Chibs, Wendy, your manufactured patch, another Tara, Bobby, Eli, then you have your Tig and Happy Duel, and your Gemma, Penny Duel, and then your numbered cards. This is a little hits recap. Out of 25, out of 10, out of 10, out of 25. 25, 25, 25, and 25. There you go, man. That's your, that's your hit stack. That's your base stack. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for your personal breaks. That was fantastic. Um, we're out of here. 2 o'clock, we're going to be bringing you a break. Um of Bowman Jumbo. So thank you very much. And um, this is our last day for a set time of personal breaks, but we will be on the next couple of days. So if you see us on and we're just hanging out, feel free to put an order in. Uh, if you want to put a personal break order in and we're not on the air, feel free to send us an email and just say, hey guys, you have a chance to do a personal break. And you know we check our email throughout the day and if we got time, we'll do it for you. So thanks again, Chris, and I uh, hope you enjoyed it.